Hi, my name is Francois de Vette, and um, this is the video that I think uh, most of you have been asking for. Uh, there's been quite a lot of people that have uh, said to me that they think I know more than what I'm letting on, and um, why don't I just uh, say things like they are, in other words, and, and um, let people deal with it and, and handle it. You know, it's not, it's not easy making this kind of video um, because what I've got to do is actually bring together three visions into one. Now, the, the one vision happened in uh, June of uh, 2015. And then the other one happened, uh, I can't remember when, I think it was January this year. And then the, the last vision happened more recently. All three of these visions were extremely graphic and intense, um, much more than any of the other visions. The Bible says, "He who lives by the sword will die by the sword." One of the one of the things that's going to be a major trigger in South Africa, and with that I close, is God showed me that there's going to be an assassination. This was last year, and I've shared it since last year. There's going to be an assassination of a political leader in South Africa of one of the smaller parties, and um, this assassination. Uh, what he said to me is, uh, the wolves are at the door. The date has been set and money has changed hands. Nowhere to run, nowhere to hide. The friends have become the foe and the place of safety, the place of betrayal. A call to violence, a call to war. This call for land shall be their end. To the right your head will be, but on the left your wound will see. A struggle for power, a call for war, divided, they will not conquer, but they will fall. It sounds like a poem, and that, but this is the word that I had in it, and it's meant to be uh, slightly obscure. But I think for anybody that uh, um, knows about many of the prophecies that have been brought about this, will understand fully what this is about. I want to just point out a few things about this. This, this assassination is going to also trigger uh, a violence in South Africa. And uh, the wolves that are at the door, the wolves it's speaking about here are foreign investors. And so this, this assassination is not going to be politically motivated, but is, but is going to be from outside South Africa, and it's going to be uh, in order to protect investments. Okay, um, the, the friends have become the foe in the place of safety, the place of betrayal, somebody close to this leader, is going to betray him and actually set up the hit, okay? Um, and they they will be calling for violence and calling to war, but it's this very and calling for land, and this is, will be the very thing that's that's going to cause his end, okay? And then to the right, uh, his head will be. In other words, this could mean physically looking to the right, or it could mean looking to the right wing. But on the left, the wound we'll see could mean that it's going to be the left that's actually going to actually be behind the assassination, or it could be uh, that it's, the wound is literally going to be on the left as well. Um, a struggle for power, a call for war, divided, they will not conquer, but they will not fall. What God showed me was that this political party is going to literally implode. It's going to disintegrate, and the reason why is because uh, everybody will want to be the next leader of this political party. Okay, now, I'm just putting it out there. Uh, some of you guys have asked me to just be absolutely honest uh, with a lot of this stuff, and, and this is part of it. And um, please don't ask me who it is. Please don't ask me to attach names to any of this. I'm just telling you uh, the way that God gave it to me, and I know that the, this is going to have major repercussions. They're going to try to, to pin it on the whites, um, but it's not going to be, it's not right wing, it's not political, this is economical and, and, uh, and for the investors it's actually going to have a very, very negative effect on their investments and that actually com uh, committing this. Um, but that's about all I know, uh, like I said, I had this word last year already and I've shared it just uh, in, in small groups and that and uh, posted it on, on some of the social media sites. Okay, that's about all for now.